Okay, so today I'm going to be picking this Packlock 400A, Pucklock, um, core on there. Um, and I'm going to be doing this as an entry for John Locke's 100 subscriber giveaway. So congratulations on getting to 100. Um, so there's the lock, we'll be picking that in a second. But while picking it, he wants us to talk about something interesting. So I'm just going to demonstrate this quickly. It's a fancy re-roll sign. Doesn't really fit in the camera frame all the way. Um, and it's incredibly heavy. Oh, cast iron. Let me just take the camera out of the mount. So you can see the whole thing. Re-roll. All right, and there you go, you've seen that now. Um, go back to filming, put this, oh, oh it's very heavy, off to the side. Um, oh, here's the key, by the way, the bidding. Um, so, let's use top of the keyway. Let's just get this going, and I'll start telling you about that one. <coughs> Also, I'm still a tiny bit sick, so I filmed about three videos today. Um, yes, so the reroll sign there comes off um, some vintage circuit breaker, uh, high voltage circuit breakers at my work um, that we've just decommissioned. So the sign is from 1941. Uh, re-roll, make, yeah, high voltage switch gear amongst other things. Um, I'm not sure if they're still doing it. I believe they've been bought out by Siemens. Um, but yeah, so it sits on top of a 6.6 thousand .6, volt um, switch gear. Um, and it doesn't anymore because we've just removed all of that switch gear from the site. Um, it's an old substation being being turned off. So now I have the sign, a nice piece of history, Oop. which I'm very happy to own. Uh, don't know what else there is to say about it other than it's very cool, very old, and it's going to find its way mounted on a, out in the garage or maybe on top of our bookshelf inside or something. I haven't really thought exactly where to mount it yet, but yeah, it's from the, the site it is from is one of uh, Melbourne in Australia's oldest um, like public substations. It's very hard to get this top pin. Oop. Okay, jiggly now. So I'm just using the SS devs for this too, by the way. Ever set that one? Maybe not. It's um, can be hard to get good feedback in this one. I might try and go up off the. Because the core is quite in there, it's hard to get a good lever action going under any of the pins, I find. So finding that one that wants the counter rotate is actually a bit of a challenge. 
least I want it to be. Maybe there's a trick to it and I just don't know. But Try and go off this bit of warding over on the... Come on, hello. Debacle of a picking attempt. Come on. Certainly not going to get a speed lock entry on this one. Um, I mean, I didn't use the key anyway. Alright, let's um, try again. Might end up zooming through some of this if this keeps up. Oh, there it is. Alright, now, <coughs> with that turned, the shackle will come out like so. Uh, there you go, like so. Um, now, unfortunately, well, you can take this Allen key out here. Um, which has just got a little pin on the end. Just goes into this groove. Um, I don't think you can gut this any further. So you can see where the pick state, that's as far as it'll turn this way. Um, so there's no risk of dumping the pins out. Um, but I don't see a way to gut it any further. Well, maybe I needed to. Hmm. Maybe is that on that one key? I think I'm supposed to do that. I really don't have the tools for that. So this is as far as I've got it. Um, I would quite like to know what's in here, but I don't want to break it. I thought I might have to smash this roll pin out, but I didn't really notice that that's an Allen key. So um, I might try and do that later. But there we go. You can see I haven't pulled anything out of it because I don't know how to open it. So that is the Packlock 400A. I've been wanting one of these. They're a cool format. Um, so congratulations again, John Locke, um, for getting to a hundred subscribers. It's a good achievement. Um, good luck on getting the next 100 and I hope I win your giveaway because you've got some cool prizes in there. So that'd be nice. 
Um, and I hope my re-roll sign was of some interest. Thanks.